In this video, I'm going to show you how to import your videos into Adobe Premiere Pro so that you can start editing your videos. So let's get into it. When it comes to importing our videos, there are three different methods of getting your footage into Adobe Premiere. So let me show you method one. Method one is to scroll down to the project window. We're going to right click, select import, and then from here, we can navigate to our video clips and we can just import them this way. And that's going to import them and we can drag them straight onto our timeline like that. That is method one. Method two, rather than importing from the project window, we can go into our finder and do the opposite of what we just did. So we can go into our finder, find the video clip that we like, and we'll drag that straight into Adobe Premiere. And there you go. From there, you can just drag that onto your timeline. Now method number three, and this method is a little bit more complicated, but it's not too complicated. We'll go into media browser. And then as you can see on the left, we've got our destination folder. So we'll go into Macintosh HD, users, Brooker Films. Of course, this is gonna be different for yourself. Go ahead, find the video clip, and that should appear here. And then you just want to right click and press import. Now, why on earth would you want to do the third technique over the first two? Because the first two are really easy. Well, the third technique is really useful when you're dealing with high-end video codecs like Red Raw, for example. A lot of high-end cinema cameras split their video clips into multiple different sections. And when you import them in the traditional way of just dragging them in or pressing import on the project window, these video clips are separated into their each individual clip but when you import them via the media browser, they're all stitched together and imported as one clip. This makes editing for yourself a lot easier. So my recommendation is if you're a beginner, you're shooting on your iPhone, or if you're intermediate, you're shooting on a DSLR, then I would suggest just going with method one or two, just import from the project window. But if you're dealing with more advanced cameras like RED cameras, Canon, Sony's, Panasonic's, if you're dealing with RAW as well, then I would recommend importing via media browser because that's really going to help you out later down the line. And there you go. That is how you import your videos into Adobe Premiere. Thank you for watching. I really appreciate your support and I will see you on the next video. See you there.